Hello and welcome to this lesson on equilibrium. This is an exam question and if we just read it very quickly, dinitrogen peroxide and nitrogen dioxide coexist in this equilibrium. A chemist adds four moles of this into a container of this volume over here. Whenever you see this, whenever you see this, it means that you've got to divide the moles in equilibrium by the this to get the concentration because remember Kc measures or is the concentration of the products over the concentration of the reagents and in this case it is N2O4 NO22 we return the end okay because we've got two moles here so it tells us the initial and it tells us the equilibrium. So if you write this down, NO2, we have a two here, initial, and we have equilibrium. And we have N2O4. So initially we had four moles, by the end we end up with 3.2. That means that we have used up 0 0.8 moles of NO2 to, you know, just NO2. So, we have used up two moles, and those two moles equal to 0 0.8. So that means, therefore, one mole is 0 0.4, because two of these would make 0 0.8. So 0 0.4 times 2 has reacted. Now, it obviously, uh, initially, we have no moles of that. And at equilibrium, we end up with 0 0.4, because the molar ratios over here is 1 to 2. So obviously, 0 0.4 moles have reacted here, and 0 0.8 moles have reacted here because that's double, that's 2. So now what we've got to do to change this into the concentration, we divide it by volume. Remember, e, N equals C times B. So if we rearrange it, it'll be N over V times C. So 3.2 divided by 2 equals 1.6. 0 0.4 divided by 2 equals 0 0.2. If you put this into the equilibrium constant, the expression, we would have K, let me do a different color, Kc equals, let's put it in brackets, it'll be 0 0.2 over 1.6 squared. Because over here, oh, uh, yeah, because over here, we have two of these, so therefore we've got to square this. Uh, obviously, it should be at the top. I don't know why I wrote it at the bottom. So, if we just calculate this on the calculator, we would end up with 0 0.0781. And to calculate the units, this will be moles per decimeter cubed. This will be moles per decimeter cubed, but times 2. So, obviously... If I write this out very quickly, mole per decimeter cubed, and we have two moles per decimeter cubed. Obviously, you can get rid of one of those and one of those, leaving us with mole minus one decimeter cubed, or decimeter cubed mole minus one. And that's the answer. So the next question asks us that um, it only tells us that the experiment is repeated, but the pressure is doubled. And it needs to tell, it, it explain in terms of Kc, the effect of the concentrations of these two when the mixture has reached equilibrium. The first thing that you do need to write is that Kc does not change. Kc only changes with temperature. So, first thing you write, Kc does not change. Or the value of Kc does not change if you want to be specific. Now you need to talk about what happens when the pressure in the container is doubled with respect to these two. So if you think about it, if we go back to the equation over here, if we increase, if we double the pressure, obviously this concentration here would increase more than this one would. So the way we would write that is that the concentration of NO2 to 
increases more than N2. Because if you think about it, we've got two moles here. We have got double the amount of moles on this side and on this side. So if we decrease the space in which they arrive in, the concentration is obviously going to be far more over here on the left than it is on the right. And then we need to talk about what happens for K uh, what happens so KC does go back to its original place. Obviously, with Le Chatelier's Le Chatelier's principle, we want to minimize the changes in the dynamic equilibrium. So therefore, seeing as we've got two moles of NO2 here, we would want to shift the position of equilibrium to the right. So therefore, the concentration of NO2 to decreases. Or the moles, if you want to write moles, that's perfectly fine. The moles of that decreases whilst N2O4 increases and therefore the overall thing is to maintain Kc or to restore the value of Kc. And that is it for this video.